clearly was resting, but was he bothered at all the time? Um, I haven't asked him. I haven't asked him, but uh, he looked. He seemed to be moving pretty well. Um, just rusty, you know. Um, not having played basketball in a few weeks, you know. Turn we turned the ball over too much. Period as a team. Um, but he started off the game with a couple. But again, just timing is off, you know. What do you think of the new starting lineup? Um, I thought it was, you know, I thought it was cool early. We still, again, turnovers kind of, you know, it was tough to start the game like that, so you didn't really get too much of a snapshot. Um, with Cody being out, you know, I had to kind of get Air, um, Larry out kind of early um, to get him ready to play the, some backup five. But we had a lot of foul trouble, so foul trouble always messes up rotations so um, you know but I thought you know I thought it was cool I mean we we played hard we got up seven and then seemed we just couldn't score for a little while you know and that that was kind of the the, the, the moment of truth in the game Uh, we was trying to trap. We was trying to trap and get a steal. Since you said you guys couldn't score there, and you were right, you were up seven with just over eight minutes left. Did, could you place that on anything, or like, did you see anything out there from their defense or your offense? Oh well, shoot, you always got to get other team credit when you don't score. Uh, obviously, they we're locking in. Uh, we got, I thought, a pretty some pretty good looks. But I just felt like we were rushing all night. You know, I just felt like we were kind of antsy all night. And uh, I was hoping that it, we was able to calm down as the game went on. But we weren't. We, did, we didn't really calm down. Uh, so I think, you know, you attribute it, you attribute it to that. And also, um, you know, late game, we have, you know, a few packages that we'd like to go to. Um, and we got a couple good looks. We just couldn't knock them down. But, you know, you got to get them credit. Ant and Ben, I think 11 for 18 on threes, if my math is correct. How imperative were they for you guys? But... Yeah, those dudes, were, those dudes were huge. They were huge. Um, ben came in and was just, you know, he was, he was spot on, man. We needed what he brought today. Uh, he just knocked down shots. He was aggressive. Um, he, was, he was that X, X Factor type of guy that, that we sometimes see with him. Um, but I think, you know, the biggest thing is you, you can't, you know, you can't have 19 turnovers, man, for 24 points. You at home. You can't do that home or on the road. Um, we talked about one of the points of emphasis against this team is when you turn it over, they score. Um, so that, that was, that was going to be tough. I mean, I thought in the first half, I mean, we had, I think, 11 turnovers, but just really unforced tough ones. But I thought it was one of our best halves of just moving the ball. I mean, we had 15 assists at the half. We really moved the ball, but you know, still with 11, 11 turnovers, and they scored on quite a bit of them. It just it, it didn't look good. You guys kind of lost that ball movement in the final six minutes or so. Huh? You think you lost some of that ball movement in the final six minutes? Yeah, I do. I do. Again, I thought you know we we were. Uh, we were rushing a little bit, you know. We were all trying to. We got up seven, and it seemed like we all were just trying to bring us back so bad, you know. Um, so we lost a little bit of that continuity. Um, but I tell you what, I got to give uh, the kid Vanderbilt. I mean, he was he was disruptive, man. He was incredible. He was incredible. I thought he took us out of a lot of our sets, denying the basketball, deflections. He comes up with that big, the huge uh, offensive rebound and dunk. You know, we fall asleep on that play there. Um, he was he was incredible, man. He really was. I thought he was a he was a game changer. What do you think of what you saw at Trent Watford tonight in his first real minute? Yeah, I, I was I was happy. I mean, I've I've grown to really trust uh, Trent, and he has just a really good feel for the game. Um, he has some some toughness that you love. Uh, he can he can handle the basketball. He can pass the basketball, and obviously he has no experience at the moment. But just being able to throw him in there, you know, um, I had visions of playing him a couple games ago, 
and I was just telling them to just be ready, be ready. And it didn't happen, but you know, obviously with Cody going down, we needed to we needed to spare our guys a few minutes, and I thought he was really good. Yeah, you guys are now five under 500. Lost to Antalya, and that's still really early in the season. But is this becoming a big concern for you? Well, the biggest concern was just trying to get healthy. To be honest with you, um, you have guys sitting out and they're coming back. You can't expect that they're just going to play like they've never set out. You know, you got to you got to plan for a little bit of that rust. Um, I think there are a lot of teams in this in our area. You know. Um, I think when we're playing well, Aaron, we can play with anybody. We've showed that. So we just have to kind of get back to getting that swagger back and when we're playing really well, in particular in this building, you know. So my biggest concern was getting healthy. And now, you know, we can start working on obviously changing the, we change the lineup. You know, there's different sets and plays that you have to get used to. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy just being healthy and we can work on the rest.